All right, now let me walk you through the operation sequence of this particular design, okay? All right, this is a reversible star delta control. Okay, let me walk you through the uh, operational sequence. But before then, let's identify different logic that is responsible for a particular function, okay? Now, this particular logic here, this kinetic, this portion, is responsible for the star delta operation here, this area now. Okay, why this other portion is for revisable function? Whichever direction of operation that is initiated here is responsible to activate that. Okay, okay, then this is the power circuit for the revisable operation. Why the whole of this other portion is power circuit for the star delta in question? Okay, then this indicator pilot lamp is responsible to illuminate telling us that the mains are active all right so each of the function that is taking place here that means if star contactor is in a closed state this lamp is going to illuminate if delta contactor is also closed this other um, pilot will also signal respectively this other mains as well for this other one all right Sorry, rather, this one, this K2 is for star operation. Then K3 is for delta operation. K1 here is for mains. Okay. All right. So let's simulate. Okay. Let's uh, go through the operation. Sorry. Before then, let's change the timing. Yeah. Let's make it three seconds. Or rather, let's leave it two seconds for just testing sake. Okay. Okay. All right, just hold on. Now I have mens here. Yeah? Mens is active. Okay, if we have any of the phase out, if we have any phase failure here, there is a protection relay here called voltage monitor that's responsible to uh, disable the function here. Yeah? If this mens, one of the phase is not active, so this voltage monitor will not allow any voltage or current to flow to this circuit. So the motor will not run okay all right let's simulate okay now i want to run the operation on four direction protection i activate this look at the arrow showing clockwise operation is running now after a few seconds delta has taken over all right let me shut down then let's test the revise function look at the arrow it's running on reverse operation backward operation yeah look at delta has taken over all right so this is how to design star delta forward and reverse operation using schematic diagram to represent the function okay all right so um if you want to register this particular course just contact me through this just about a few video for you to understand this Okay, about five or six videos for you to understand the logic. You start from beginning to the end. It's a very simple logic. Okay, all right. Thank you.